Hey guys, hope you're doing well. I um, just want to say thanks for those of you who joined me on the live stream yesterday morning. That was pretty fun. A couple hours of listening to your requests. I think there was almost 15 songs or so I listened to, between 10 and 15. So that was pretty fun. Um, today we're going to listen to another song by this uh, Deer and Gray band. And I listened to one yesterday during the live stream, and I listened to one, maybe two other ones, got some, uh, a couple reaction videos. So this one's called Revelation of Mankind, and let's check it out. Wow, 
That's an intense song, an intense message. Um, it was nice having the subtitles, although I don't think they translated entirely correctly. Um, but just trying to piece together the lyrics they had with what I was looking at, um, you know, it's interesting having, uh, showing people watching their band on YouTube and whatever that scenario was with the man and woman hanging, uh, from a noose that's connected to each other. And then, um, like being threatened and all that stuff kind of bloodied up. But then I guess it wasn't real. Um, and then the guy watching though at the end, maybe he thought it was real or something. He had a noose hanging from above his bed and with the siren, maybe they're implying that he hung himself or, uh, something like that. Um, song is called Revo the revolution of mankind or revelation of mankind. Sorry. And, uh, yeah, I think it speaks to kind of the, the world we live in today, which consumes lots of media, uh, of all kinds, social media and video, YouTube. Um, there's just an endless supply of limitless information and, uh, not all of it's real. And I guess that's what they're getting at. You know, maybe someone who's being shaped by what they're watching, even though it's not real. So that's an unfortunate truth for some people. Musically, uh, it was pretty good, pretty and pretty aggressive. Uh, the first song I listened to by them wasn't all that, uh, aggressive and I didn't really like it all that much. And I had many people tell me that that wasn't really a good representation of their music. So the song I listened to yesterday and then now this one are, were way different than that first one. A lot more heavy, uh, a lot more faster. <clears throat> the vocals are like tons more screaming and the stuff he was doing in that, in this song were just uh, off the wall, like screeches and all kinds of crazy stuff. Um, so I liked it. Yeah, it was good. Um, yeah, I'm curious if they do any songs in English. I'd be, I'd be interested in hearing that if they sing in English at all. Uh, so yeah, cool. Thanks for that recommendation. And um, I'm going to sign off now. I'm actually going to go see The Princess Bride in theaters for the 30th anniversary. It's one of the greatest movies ever made, in my opinion. And I'm, I'm wondering if the movie theater is going to be filled with people who have seen it a million times, like me, and are going to be quoting it out loud while the movie's going, because that would be kind of annoying. Even though everyone probably knows all the lines, uh, I don't know. I don't like people talking during movies. So, anyhow, thanks for watching, and hope to uh, get some more request uh, videos made for you guys. So, I appreciate all the song suggestions, and I'm. I have lists, but there's only so many songs I can do at a time. So thank you again. Bye for now.